All right, so today I have an unboxing video plus a giveaway. One of these pairs of shoes is gonna go to one of you guys out there, and it is a new technology from Under Armour that I'm really excited to show you guys. What is going on guys, Hess here from CollectiveKicks.com. If you guys want to shop the top sneaker deals of the week, check the link in the description and happy shopping. Thank you to Wendy and the good folks over at Hibbit Sports because they sent me actually one pair for myself and then they said let's go ahead and throw in another pair for you to give away to your subscribers. So hopefully this is going to be fun for you guys out there. I'll have the rules in just a second but let's go ahead and show you guys the product first. So we have a new technology from Under Armour that is really something else. And uh, it is called Hover, as you can see from the box. These are going to be available February 1st, and I'll have a link in the description for you guys interested in purchasing these um, to Hibbets Sports. So, this is one of the shoes that I ended up getting sent to me. This is my size, and this is the new Hover Phantom model, as you can see on the box. It's UA Hover Phantom CT is what the box label says right here. So I went with a nine and a half and that is my true to size on this model. And I actually really like the overall look of this new model. It has a really sleek new design and it's really kind of intriguing because you could see that red cushioning system in the middle of the midsole. And that is the hover cushioning system as you can see. And it's pretty cool when you see it up close. It's definitely a really soft, responsive foam type material and it's housed inside of the midsole. So it's similar, I guess, in a sense to Nike Lunarlon, but this material definitely feels a little bit more responsive than something like Lunarlon. And I like the fact that they have the guts exposed a little bit so you know what it is and, and that it is actually something separate. So I don't think a lot of people, including myself, didn't know that Lunarlon was actually encased inside the harder foam on the outside. These definitely do a better job of showcasing that. So the other big thing that this has is it has integration to Map My Run, which for those people that are diehard runners out there, you guys already know about Map My Run, but these can be integrated with use of that app, which is a huge plus to those people that actually want to use um, that to track their, their runs and whatnot. My first impressions of these are actually really good. It has somewhat of a neoprene liner in the inside, but then the actual insole is kind of like a gel feel, which is kind of nice. And then it has this weird little button right here on the bottom that's really, really responsive. And I did try these things on feet and I wanted to go ahead and give them a go as soon as I got them home and I wanted to, to see how they felt and they felt really good. So just a little bit about this new midsole. It's made from Ophelin and it was designed by Down Chemists. It's called UA Hover Foam, H-O-V-R and it's a lightweight alternative to the commonly used EVA foam. This proprietary foam is encapsulated in the material that the company calls Energy Web. The package, which is the foam plus the external web material, is the heart of the hover technology. The webbing is actually the red part. It doesn't look like it from a distance, but up close you can see that. So this combination lets the shoe absorb some of the impact your body would normally feel, uh, aiding in your comfort and keeping your legs fresh. They're gonna have a couple different hover models. This is the Phantom. They also have a Sonic, which is a low top running shoe. And let's go ahead and show you guys the other one, which is the one that I'm going to be giving away. Alright, so I have a size 12 here of the Phantoms as well. But if you guys follow me on social, you guys saw me teasing these already on Twitter and Instagram. So as you can see, this is the red pair and these ones are really, really clean also. And again, size 12 and I'm going to be giving these away in this video. Um, compliments of Hibbit Sports. So let's go ahead and get into the rules for this giveaway. It's super, super simple, which most of my giveaways are. So number one, all you have to do is be a subscriber and like the video. And then number two, just leave any comment in the comment section, but you also must include the hashtag UAHOVR. And lastly, you can only enter the giveaway one time, but you can't enter it from anywhere in the globe. So keep that in mind. The winner will be chosen on the 7th of February and I will let you guys know on social media, Instagram or Twitter. And I'll also update the description of this video to let you guys know who the winner was. Since I usually do a lot of giveaways that are nine and a half because that's my size, I opted that they actually send me a larger size for you larger feet people out there. Hopefully a 12 is good enough for some of you guys out there. If not, you can still enter the contest and then just trade to a friend that actually is a size 12. But this is a great opportunity for you guys to try the new technology before it releases. The price point isn't too bad on the shoe either. It's $130 and I believe it's $140 with the Map My Run integration. The low top version is $100 and $110 uh, respectively. So that is kind of it about the shoe. All in all, like I'm actually really excited to give these a try. Do you guys want 
to have me do a detailed review and a comparison to other sneaker cushioning technologies on the market. It's kind of something that I do on this channel already, so these fit right in at home. The fact that we have stuff like Adidas Boost and Nike has a new React, but this is definitely right up my alley with its new cushioning technology, and it's something that I can't wait to give more of a run. One other note about this shoe, this upper material is actually kind of themed by bike shorts, like bicyclist shorts. It has like almost like a neoprene wetsuit type of feel to this little kind of cage sort of area. And then it has a knit material in the toe box and then a knit material around the ankle as well. So it's snug around the ankle and it has a little bit of a heel cup um, on the back as well. I think the overall aesthetics on the shoe look really good. And the combination between the gel-like sort of insole as well as this new hover foam mixed with some dual tech sort of upper is just a really cool combination for a pair of sneakers. And for $130, it's a great entry level price point, in my opinion. On feet, these things feel really good as well. They definitely have a good responsiveness and it feels like a lot of cushioning with every step that you end up taking. But I'm really excited to give these a try casually. And if you guys want, again, leave a comment. Let me know if you want me to follow up with a detailed bidding kind of comparison to some of the other sneaker technologies out there. That's pretty much it for the video though. Again, to enter the giveaway, all you have to do is follow the rules that I detailed in this video. And if you can't remember all of the rules, just check the description and I'll have all of those details in the description for this giveaway. So good luck to you guys out there trying to enter. Um, thank you again to Hibbit and, and Wendy for sending these my way and I cannot wait to give these a go. What do you guys think about these first impressions? Leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know your thoughts on the new technology and what kind of questions you guys may have about the shoe. Maybe I can answer that in a review in the future. But that is the end of the video. Um, be sure to subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Let you guys be notified when I post new videos. And if you guys want to see some other videos on my channel, you just click the screen at this time. Thank you guys for stopping by. Have a good one. Peace, guys.